Good. Um, I would like to tell you more about our initiative, we move for climate, and our perspective is slightly different from what you've seen before since um, Fisman, our company, we're not coming from the healthcare industry, we're not coming from the sports industry, like we're a family-owned company and our, our business is mainly the climate solutions and the heat pump productions, but since we have 14,000 employees, uh, for us, this uh, sport, healthcare, and activation are very, very important topics. But before we jump into the discussing it, um, I have a question to you. Can you guess what this number stands for? And the hint, it has to do something with the climate crisis or climate change. Maybe to give another hint, uh, 36 billion or almost 37 billion, uh, these are the billion of tons of the CO2 emissions that we did emit globally last year. And this is absolute record that we as humanity have produced ever. And um, not a big question, we all know where it is leading us. So if you turn on the TV, you always see this news, for example, horrible wildfires in the Turkey, or uh, this drought in Spain, you can see on these two images, like there was a lot of water then the drought came and just this uh, tragic uh, photo they can see from Chile that happened just a few days ago. So the climate crisis is very big threat to us the humanity but unfortunately it's not the only kind of battlefield that we have to face. Um, two years ago we started the global pandemic which was insane um, like no one knew how it will develop and what how it will impact us and Literally, when the global pandemic was two steps to be over and we were expecting that our life will come back to the normal, then the war in Ukraine has started. War in Ukraine has also forced, um, on top to the all uh, problems next to it, the energy crisis that we have in the Europe and the climate crisis. And there are so many topics we need to address, like individually, but also as the companies. We all understand that we need to act already now. And um, all the companies, no matter which size, is it a smaller company, is it a bigger corporate company, we all know that we want to do something for sustainability. But what is one of the important learnings also for me that sustainability in the company is not something that is implemented, let's say, by the sustainability manager or sustainability department. If you really want to do it successfully, it has to be done like in the entire organization, meaning that you have to take your employees along this journey. And only in this case, it will be working successfully. But coming back to other goals that you have in your companies that um, you need to work for sustainable solutions. But of course, you also want to make your brand or your company more visible and more attractive for users. So then you need to do also marketing and uh, some brand advertising or brand topics. And next to it, of course, um, there's still, we have the so-called war of talents, meaning that uh, for your company, uh, you want to have best employees and you want to keep the best employees so they don't leave. So we're talking about the employee retention and employer branding. And usually what happens is that you have sustainability department, you have marketing department, you have HR, and everyone try to do their best to kind of um, perform in these three fields. But what I tell you that, we at Fisman tried to look at these challenges and try to develop the approach that would actually tackle all these three topics simultaneously. And this is how we came up with the VIMO for climate or shortly the VIMO, how we call it. Um, what does it mean and how, how did it start? It? So it was the year 2020, so famous, painful first lockdowns that were had here in the Europe, but also in the Germany. And that was from the marketing or like from the business perspective, unique situation, we're on the lockdown, employees working mostly from the um, home offices or remotely, and we have budget, we have resources, but basically we couldn't launch so many projects we were planning. So let's say, and you also know this, no exhibitions, no customer events, basically nothing. So we had a lot of, um, brainstorming sessions and feastment over thinking like okay, what can we do what can we do and ideally uh, we also wanted to bring to our employees and at feastment we have now um, i think around fourteen thousand employees worldwide so many countries and we also knew that people of course because of this covid that people are stressed people need to have this feeling of the like 
of a real team that we're one family, that everything is going to be all right. So we really wanted to cheer that up. And this is how we came up with this concept of the VMOVE. So what is the VMOVE? Very, very, very simple idea. And that's why I like it so much that um, at the beginning uh, or like during the first campaign, we were encouraging our employees to do sports. It could have been yoga, biking, whatever they prefer. And we at Fisman were pledging um, to plant one tree for each of the sports activities they were doing. So for example, one hour yoga, one tree, 10 kilometers biking, one tree, and so on. And um, because in this way, we can do something for people because then they are getting more active. Even thought, for example, we cannot collect them to the firm in love because of the COVID restrictions. So doing some sports uh, is good. Then we have good benefit for the um, employer branding because again, we had a very strong social media presence on top of that and very good marketing. Um, so during this first campaign, uh, people were doing this sports, I think it was two weeks, and we were collecting the data simply by emails. And you can imagine having 14,000 people, how many emails in two weeks it was, because every time someone was writing, okay, I did yoga today, so it's one tree, hey, Fisman, please plan. And we had all sponsoring department trying to make the list and then calculate how many trees we did plant. And then we did this campaign once, we did this campaign twice, and um, like on this slide, you can see the ratio that we had. So uh, in the VMOVE, we have uh, now almost 40 sports activities. But we saw that um, this initiative had been taken so positive by our, by our employees that we want to continue to do it, but we don't want to take um, another 10,000 emails. We also want to have better user experience for our, for our employees, but also friends and family, because that was another aspect that uh, when we started the campaign, our employees were asking like, hey, is it fine if my wife join? Uh, can my kids also meet uh friends and family? And of course, we <clears throat> were happy and like more people you have, more like positive impact you get. So that was the moment that we realized that uh, it's time to make a little um, investment and also effort. And we started to develop our own in-house app. And we call it, of course, the VMOVE. Uh, the VMOVE now uh, consists from the web app. Also, we have native Android, also native um, um, Apple iOS app. And um, how does it work? That people, of course, during these campaigns, when they use the VMOVE, they can either um, upload activities manually. So it can be screenshot, it can be photo. And then the VMOVE converts uh, it into the trees. Or you can also have synchronization, for example, with the Garmin watch, or we also have synchronization with Strava. Strava, and soon we will have the API to Google Fit and Apple Health. And uh, one of the like important aspects of the VMOVE uh, and why is it good for the employer branding is the social media aspect, because um, we developed uh, the app in the way that once someone is uploading activity, so let's imagine you did your workout in the morning, you upload it to the VMO, then you see, oh, okay, I get uh, three trees for this. Um, then VMO suggests you to post this, like your contribution directly on the social media from the app, meaning your colleagues or your friends, if you want, they can see this, meaning that uh, you inspire others also to join and also to make their contribution to this little um, climate action. And um, yeah, for the employer branding, we couldn't wish for best because it's a very authentic, uh, user-generated content. Um, so these campaigns in the beginning in the Vimo of app, they were internal, uh, like at Fisman only, but then friends and families. And then we also realized that we can do these campaigns together or for other companies. And one of the campaigns we did was together with IBU. So IBU, it's International Biathlon Union. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, we did a big campaign in August last year. Uh, it was international. So in the VMOF app, we had eight teams and each of the team was led by one Biathlon superstar. And uh, we were encouraging our employees, but also other users to join one of these teams and kind of compete uh, by making sports and collecting the trees. And um, climate, uh, climate activities are always remaining very important aspect uh, or yeah, very important aspect focus of the VMOVE, but we also realized that we can use it for other topics or like bringing it uh, to 
other, let's say, social, social responsibility goals. And that's why uh, when the war in Ukraine started, we have conducted a campaign that we called Vimo for Ukraine. So the mechanic was simple. We were offering people to do sports, but then in the VMOV app, uh, we had FISMAN, we were converting these sports activities into donations uh, for the Ukraine, for Ukrainian refugees. Meaning you do sports, you collect some euros, and then at the end, um, yeah, FISMAN did this donation. And uh, we were very happy that we could support uh, so many people with this. Or um, another campaign also beyond the climate goals was the campaign we did together with Garmin. Uh, Garmin, you definitely know everyone, the fitness watch um, brand. And last year, together, we did campaign for the Pink October. And Pink October, this is International uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And uh, we did this campaign in more than 20 countries. And people were able to choose which, um, for which country um, people were able to choose which country they want to support, meaning in each country there were one uh, charity that uh, supports uh, either like victims or researchers on uh, fighting the breast cancer. And uh, we had so many people coming and participating and we were happy that like with the beam of platform that initially started as the little initiative like for Fisman and police during the COVID, now we can do something with people from different companies in different countries and we can do something also to support uh, people who are having like um, hard uh, times maybe with some illnesses and um, we're really looking forward to have even like more opportunities to adjust Vimo or to develop the Vimo that we can support um, even more. And um, our impact so far since we move is now almost three years old. Uh, we have more than 20,000 users. So you can see that at Fitman we have 14,000 employees, so meaning we have much more people coming to us. We already planted in these three years more than 1 million trees. And uh, of course, we're looking forward to see uh, how can we even like leverage and uh, have even bigger impact. And um, if I could ask you also to leave this presentation with one key takeaway, I would say that there are so many challenges that we have now, and sometimes it's very demotivating, but uh, let's try to think how can we maybe unite our efforts and try to tackle all these challenges together because together we can make great things happen. Thank you very much.